Welcome back. Scott Reviews Things. How are you all doing? Hope you're keeping splendidly well. I can't remember the last video I recorded that wasn't beer. <laughs> Quite beer heavy the last few weeks. Reviews and top fives and just all that sort of rubbish. So if you're not here for the beer, I do apologize. If you're here for not not here for oh, whatever. Um, I bought some crisps. I'm still on a diet. I've lost over two stone now. Ugh. Running, walking, not drinking so much, not eating so much crap. So I bought some crisps. I thought I'd show you. Because I've seen these around for a little while. Never picked them up. Now, I'm allowed to review the crisps, but apparently not allowed to review any restaurants or uh, pubs or establishments because Jane gets a bit shitty about it. Uh, Jane Marrett, 1885. 139 years old she is, old bag. There are so many channels doing reviews on pubs, restaurants and takeaways. What gives these channels the right to give their opinion on people's businesses? I presume you're all qualified in food and drink or making comments that could make some businesses go under. Please, if you are not qualified in the food sector, don't make comments on the food you are served. There are plenty of advice on TripAdvisor for people to follow and make their own decisions on places to eat and drink. It's becoming monotonous. A bit like your fucking message then, Jane, isn't it? Um, I bought some of these. Cheese it. Cheese thin and crispy. Am I allowed to review these, Jane? Leave a comment below. Oh, cow. Uh, baked with 100% real cheese. Cheese and chilli baked snacks. Now, obviously, being on a diet, I have to be careful around calories. So, I thought I'd call what these are. This is a 150 gram bag, and it's quite full. Uh, nutrition per 100 calories. Four, uh, sorry, 100 grams. 500 calories. Oh, fuck. So they're quite heavy. 30 grams of 150 calories. So, one, what's that? Three, six, nine, twelve, fifty-five 3, 6, 9, 12, 55 times. A lot. There's a lot of calories in these. I don't even know who makes them. But I think I've seen them in Tesco's for a little while now. Snack. Let's see if we can find the English. Thin and crispy baked snacks with cheese and cheese chilli seasoning ingredients. Dark Revolution Brewing have messaged me on uh, Instagram. Uh, wheat flour, sunflower oil starch, dehydrated potatoes. Sounds like me. Cheese and chilli seasoning, lactose, milk, whey powder, milk, cheese powder, milk, salt, onion powder, butter powder, pow milk, yeast extract, flavourings, spices, chilli, acids! Lactic acid, citric acid, acidity regulator, sunflower oil, colour, paprika extract, herbs, oregano, multidextrin cheese, milk, oats, fight, fucking Jesus. They don't sound too good for you if I'm completely honest. So I'm not going to have a great deal. I don't think anybody else is going to eat them. Maybe I'll give them to the, the boys at work. They had another one, just cheese. I think they were just cheesy ones. I don't, I don't know. Crisps in the bag. Sniff my crisps. Oh, you, can smell the, you can smell the paprika, all right? And the cheese. Smell my cheese, your mother! And there we go. That is... A bit more fat here, don't we? A cheese it snapped. Of course, you can. Yeah. Cheesy. They got a nice crunch to them. I'll give them that. Nice and cheese. Not a lot of um, uh, chilli. Not enough chilli for my liking. But they do have a nice cheesy. Um, don't eat with your mouth or your fat cunt. Oh, I've used a C word. 
I'll do apologise. That's out there now, isn't it? Fuck it. Nice. Really cheesy, bit of paprika, not enough chilli for my liking. If you're going to say chilli and cheese, I want to taste that chilli. Just, that's how I am. But, they ain't bad, I'll say that. They are quite nice. They're very Moorish. Now, I can't have any more, otherwise I'll put that two stone back on. Instantly, when I've got all that bag, might have two more. There you go. Oh, wait too. I've, all, I've all put two pounds on this week just because of these crisps. But they are very nice. I don't know where they're from. Cheeseit.com. Distributed by Kellogg's Marketing and Sales Company. Are they a, a Kellogg's product? I don't know. Someone's going to tell me in the comments, I suppose, if anybody fucking watches this little crap. They're all right. Not enough. Chili. I say chili. I want to feel the chili. I want to feel the burn, dude. Um, I'm going to give them a thumbs up, though, because they're quite nice. <laughs> They'd be nice in a sandwich. And they do like leave coat your mouth with a nice cheese. So, yeah. Cheese it snapped. Cheesy, thin and crispy. I'd like a little bit more chilli, but I'm not going to hold that against them. I'm not that sort of person. So, if you've tried them, leave me a comment down below. They're available in most of these big supermarkets now, I think. Um, let us know what you think of them. If you like your video, get a thumbs up. If you don't get a thumbs up, there, get a thumbs up from Scott. Um, yeah. There's a subscribe button somewhere. See you soon.